Okay guys, so for today's video, we are gonna be doing a organizing, cleaning, maybe a little bit of declutter on, I think most of my eyeshadow drawer and maybe my lip drawer, but this one's not as bad as my bottom one. So I like watching these type of videos on TikTok mostly, so I thought I would bring it to YouTube and film a YouTube video. We're just gonna get started. So first thing I'm gonna do is clean. So I'm gonna take everything out and then just wipe out the drawer this one's like my worst one so don't judge i really want to do like i do with my i did with my mac blushes and my kylie blushes and depart these color pop palettes and my dose of color palettes and just put them on like one palette or something but for now i'm just gonna empty all of this out Okay, so yeah, this one's like really, really bad. It really needs to be clean. So now that it's all nice and clean, I'm gonna put everything back. I I might put it how I had it, I don't know. This stuff I definitely want to go in the back because it's more like memories than it is makeup. Like I have Makeup Geek eyeshadows, um, my Anastasia Contour Kit, my Nicole Guerrero Highlighter Palette, and I don't really use these anymore. So I do like to keep these in the back because I'm just not gonna reach for them. It's like this little travel mirror that I got like a long, long time ago. So I just put this back here. I might just have to keep them in the back. I think these will stay out. No. And I have like color pop palettes. So I guess I will just keep those in the back. Okay, and then this one like barely misses it, so I'll put it back here. And I don't know. Ugh. Literally none of these, so I have to stack them. We have my ColourPop palettes. I do like to keep these ones together just because I think they look nice until I finally deplot them. Okay, I just watched some of these shadows in here. This is the Sahara Nights palette by Eloise. But um, they actually have some really nice shimmer, so I think I'll just keep. I'm gonna take this off. So I was actually thinking about potting or getting rid of this, but I think I'm gonna keep it. Okay, that kind of is annoying, but this one has nothing, but this one just has Q-tips in it. So have my little Huda Beauty palettes. I have one up here. Um, don't ask why. I literally don't know. And actually. I put this Natasha Denona palette down here if it fits. Oh, I know this. Actually, that fit perfectly. So, yeah, I use this one like the most out of all three of these, but I normally keep them here, but I kind of. Okay, well, I don't know about that. But then I also have this little like container thing that has like my heavy metal shadow, like liquid shadows, and then my. Little makeup by Mario. Um, the thing for his liquid shard are those like metal shadows, and then I have some things from Dew palettes. Then I just have some like single shadows that I think I'm just gonna put somewhere. Oh, actually, fits like that. I don't know where I'm gonna put these in, so I'm just gonna wait. So this is my drawer that I use like a lot a lot. These have a lot of my higher end palettes and then I have face palettes back here. I don't love having my face palettes in here, but I don't have room in this drawer. So I'm just gonna do the same thing and take these out and then clean it.
So now that it's all nice and clean, we're just gonna do the exact same thing. So I probably won't talk much, just so you can it'd be like relaxing or whatever. So. I decided to go ahead and do my cream blush slash bronzer, highlighter, all that. And it does have some like face pots. This is like my worst drawer. Okay, don't judge me. So I have like big bronzers back here, like the Marc Jacobs one and the Charlotte Tilbury. And then I have like palettes. Then I have some like littler face palettes that wouldn't fit down there or, you know, they're just like smaller. And then just a bunch of random stuff this one is like my worst drawer not even gonna lie but yeah i thought we would go ahead and clean this one too so i'm just gonna take this out okay and these are like the palettes that depot so these are my matte blushes my kylie blushes and these are like the kylie bronzers with like a couple blushes in it and then these just have some like random like ofra highlighters and stuff that i don't use very often but Okay, so I took everything out of this like container and I'm going to clean it. It's not too bad. I moved on to my limb tour. I had no idea I was not filming. I thought I was filming this whole entire time, but I already took everything out and I've already, yeah. I've already cleaned the door, so that's annoying. But yeah, I've already put, I have skincare backups back here. So I already put those in the bag and now I'm just gonna clean my lip products. I'm gonna let this lip gloss go because I never reached for it and I literally think I've used it one time so I'm just gonna give it to a family member. Okay, so that is that door. And then I just keep this little like 
summer prize tin in here. Okay, we're gonna move on to my other lipstick drawer. This is gonna be the last one that I do. I might make a, mark, a part two if you guys like this, like cleaning, organizing series, and do my foundation, primer drawer, skincare drawer, and then my powder, blush, bronzer, and highlighters. Those, like, I need to, like, really actually, like, organize instead of, like, clean. So, this one is, like, really bad. Like, so bad. But I have, um, this one is a very random drawer, too. I have a lot of loose powder back here because I just don't have anywhere to really feel like I could put them. And then I have, like, my bullet lipsticks. So this is the ones I use a lot because I use mostly bullet lipsticks now. And I just have a couple, like, random samples. realize i'm missing one of these lipsticks i have four maybe it's in my purse that is the end of this video those are all of the drawers i want to reorganize and kind of just clean again this wasn't really like a decluttering video but i thought it would just be fun to like i love watching like some of my favorite parts about the clutters is like the asmr sounds and like listening to them like clean and like put everything back so yeah let me know if you want to see a part two i can definitely do a part two of this and just clean out my other drawers and yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you in my next one. Bye!